The mouse force swim test is a common test used to predict antidepressant efficacy. This movie demonstrates the procedures of the mouse version of the forced swim test. The mouse version is different from the rat version and should not be used interchangeably. In the forced swim test, mice are placed in a tank filled with water. The mouse remains in the tank for six minutes. The subject's behaviors are recorded during this time. At the end of the six minute test period, the subject is taken out of the water. After the test is completed, the visual recordings are transferred to a computer or video monitor for analysis. An observer measures the time a mouse spends struggling during the last four minutes of the six minute session. Antidepressant medications increase the amount of time mice spend struggling. This is reflected by shorter periods of immobility time. Hello, my name is Sean from the laboratory of Dr. Todd Gould at the University of Maryland School of Medicine. Hi, I'm Chantel from the same lab. In this video, we are going to show you how to perform and score the mouse version of the forced swim test. The mouse force swim test is used to evaluate the potential efficacy of antidepressant treatments. So let's dive in, shall we? We use transparent cylindrical tanks made of a sturdy material such as plexiglass. Dimensions of the tank are selected to prevent the mice from escaping and touching the bottom with either their feet or tail. Fill the tank with tap water to the predetermined and marked level. Adjust the water temperature. It should be between 23 and 25 degrees Celsius. The water tanks should be arranged for videotaping. In our lab, we perform the forced swim test with four to five subjects at a time. Between the tanks, we place dividers to prevent subjects from observing.